Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part 114 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 4, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now this weapon is for Zhang He, suggested by GameAnyone user Vergon, and he wants me to do Zhang He. So to get his weapon, you have to go to Battle Jieting Wei Forces. So let's get started. Okay, I built him up quite a bit, but not too much. You know what? Nobody suspects the butterfly. Why not? His wings kind of remind me of Taboo from Smash Brothers Brawl. Anyways, I got his weapon at level 9, as you should, of course. That goes without saying. Usually the typical setup, I wanted to go with that. Especially the wind scroll, because he's got claws. And why not make them a little bit longer? For extra damage potential. Surround Masu's camp Seal the base without being detected by the enemy. Okay, so obviously for this objective, defeat three of Masu's sub-officers. There's usually one on each side of his base. So first go for Gao Xiang over here. Usually when I get to this juncture, I like to go for the crossbowman first. Otherwise, I am never gonna be able to execute a combo again. And they are just problematic. Zhang He's third charge is actually pretty cool. I mean, you can get a lot of blows if you hit an officer. And the final blow will make them dizzy. The fourth charge, well, it leaves a little bit to be desired because you're going to be moving a very large distance. Almost like a Psycho Crusher from Street Fighter. I mean, I'll be happy to show that up later, but for now, I'd rather just deal with this guy. I do like his fifth charge, because you can do a nice bit of damage in aerial combos. Oh, I forgot there's still a crossbow man alive. The Musa was also a little bit to be desired as well. So, I mean, you had to aim at all times. Hurry. If we stall, they will detect us. Well, there's not really a race against time, however, if you take too long, you'll have to deal with the reinforcements as well. Which you'll also have to defeat after beating Masu. It just makes things a bit of a struggle if you got too many officers to fight at once. That being said, next is Liao Hua over here. Then I gotta go to the north to face Wang Ping. Yep, yeah, that's that fourth charge I was telling you about. Yes! Look at that combo! Once I get the Vorpal Orb ready to go, I mean, that's lots of power right there. Back off, he's mine! I could use some extra health. Well, my attacks are not very quiet, and the butterfly is pretty lethal in any kind of noise. I mean, look at these wings. I mean, isn't that awesome and graceful at the same time? People may think that's gaudy, but I mean, sometimes you just gotta appreciate the finer things. Okay, Wang Ping should not be far behind. At least some of Yi's son is keeping himself very busy. I appreciate that. Oh! There's some crossbow men over there on that side. Huh, <laughs> like I said, shall we dance? Like, he says it so diabolically. I mean, he looks like a very beautiful being, and yet when he uses his Muso, it just sounds so creepy. I actually like that a lot. It's actually a pretty good character if you can use him properly. Again, charge attacks leave a little bit to be desired. He's not all about power, he's all about like quick strikes that cover a lot of ground. So, he's got that going for him. If you're looking for power, this is not the guy for you. But remember, quick strikes can really add up. Oh! 
kind of figure that was going to happen. That was my bad for using a Muso. I forgot the Dynasty Warriors 4 law is that if you're crossing Muso on Muso, you always, 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 always lose. Or maybe you'll draw, which is pretty much the same thing. How can I face the Prime Minister after this? I must lay at least one blow on Sima Yi. That's not my horse. Alright, Masu, I'm gonna cut you down in ribbons. And maybe everything else. If you're lucky, I might cut you into confetti. Hey, 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 where are you going? Am I not beautiful enough for you? The reinforcements are gonna come anyway before you defeat Masu, so don't think you can get too aggressive. You have chosen the next command. It seems you have an eye for that. Alright, Masu, you're not gonna live long enough to be executed by Juga Liang after this. The enemy is strong. Just remember the reinforcements are gonna converge on me, pretty much. Yue Ying might not. She might just stay around to protect her husband. Who right now is commander? Damn it! There, Masu is defeated. Now to defeat Zhao Yun, Wei Yan, and Yue Ying to get the weapon. Oh, you're an elite guard. Good. Oh, Wei Yan decided to show up. Well, let me fuel up. Okay. Perfect. I'll just eat a whole chicken. And I'll still maintain a good figure. Metabolism, y'all. Well, let's just face it. In real life and in the Romance of the Three Kingdoms novel, Zhang Ho was not this gaudy. At this point in the history line, he was pretty old. But he still fought with honor. In fact, they had to fight with honor, otherwise it'd be executed. Lots of commanders at that time held honor in very high regard. They didn't care how skilled you were. If you were dishonorable, they don't want you around at all. Damn it, I almost had Wei Yan beaten. Perfect. It'll be even perfecter if... No, that's not a real word. If this would actually give me a pretty good item. Oh yeah, I left my horse around here because I was pursuing Masu. Okay, I'll go to the north and deal with Zhao Yu next. Okay, so far so good. I mean, the difficulty is on max. However, this is not a hard map. If you built up your character pretty good, or at least got some good level items, you should have no problems here. Oh, there he is. Yeah, there's a couple crossbow men over here. They cannot live. Neither can you, Zhao Yun. Ah. If I can just trim down some of these numbers, that'll be good. Oh, yeah, there's crossbow man still alive. This guy's like literally immortal. I mean, this crossbow man's been around for freaking ever. That yeah, that guy over there, like, how the hell is he living through all this? Oh my god! Can I stay on my feet for longer than three seconds? Thank you, crossbow man, for finally giving up the ghost. You lived a good life, but all good things come to an end. Oh, that's arrows. I didn't really want to pursue that. Ah, the Psycho Crusher move. 
it's hard to aim, but it does a lot of damage when it ever hits someone. That's the thing about like one-shot moves. They're hard to aim, but they're high-powered. That's that fifth charge I was telling you about. That's pretty cool. You get more than one blow with that. Ah, damn it. Oh, almost had him. No. You thought you could get away, huh, Zhao Yun? Alright, so only one more officer I have to defeat, and that's Yue Ying. But first, I should head over to the main camp and see if there's a Musou one there. Actually, I don't think Zhang Hun needs Musou anymore. He should already be at max rank for that. But let me double check here, just in case. Yeah, he already has, like, max rank. Okay. No, not the objectives. Where's Yue Ying, too? Ah, over there, right next to Zhuge Liang. You know, you two could spend a little less time from each other, otherwise you're just gonna be sick of one another. I'm always sick of couples, like, uh, having to do everything all the time. Like, I have to go to work all the time, we have to go to battle Jia Ting all the time. Have some personal space, okay? Otherwise, you two are just gonna hate each other. And then end up on NBC News. You know, 220 AD, so to speak. I am a warrior before I am a woman. Screw it, I'm gonna duel you. Famous last words. Let us proceed gracefully. Alright, Yue Ying, let's fight it out. Well, that was an excellent start. Oh, come on! She literally no-sold that! There we go! Now that's one way to get a weapon. Alright, before I deal with Zhuge Liang, I'm gonna go ahead and get that dim sum. It should be in this corner. Hmm. Did I screw it up? Thought I would have had it or something. Huh. Obviously I did not get the weapon. Thought I would have. Or maybe I was just too slow. Oh well. It was worth a try. It was going so well at the time. At least I'll be built up. Yeah, I tried. So I'll just finish him off. Be done with it. What did I do wrong, anyway? I thought I did everything right. I mean, I got all the blows, that's what I needed to do. Is there a time limit tied to do things? I wonder. That was going so well, too. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's doing so good too. 
And, you know, I could have had that weapon. So I gotta think about what I did wrong. Then I have to do it again. Well, wait, I did get the weapon! For some reason, I wasn't even paying attention to what was going on. I was like, when did I unlock it? Because as soon as I defeated Yue Ying, nothing popped up. Man, I'm totally retarded now. I'm so embarrassed. Thinking I messed up the weapon, turns out I had it unlocked well ahead of time. And did not even realize it. I'm going to have to go back to this video and find out what exactly I did that determined the unlock. Wow. Was it after I defeated Zhao Yun or something? Hmm. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video right here, and then in the next episode, we get another weapon. Goodbye, everyone. Wow, that was... this is very awkward.